What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you my controller keybinds and they're actually one of a kind but you can switch them around if you want but um, let's just get straight into it. There we go. So you definitely want to have custom controller binds because if you pick one of the other ones it just kind of messes around a little bit. Sprint is right, target, next weapon, all this, all this don't really change. Place marker, left, crouch, right click. Change material left, trap use square. I mean, if you use anything else than these, then I don't know what you're doing. Toggle map, you definitely want this. Yeah, that was glitched out for me, I remember. Toggle inventory up, emote down. Okay, so this is where it gets a little difficult because I made switch mode left click on the um, analog stick. But you can make it edit if you want, and that might make, make it easier for you. I'm not sure. Select, confirm, reset, all that's pretty easy. Toggle map, yep. Toggle inventory, yep. Edit building. So see, I have my edit building as circle, but you can easily change this to left stick if you want. It, either or other is perfectly fine, but I picked circle, but it's a bit too much to do on like that one side, if you know what I mean, if you've ever had that. And then the rest of this um, is completely fine. Don't really change any of this. So yeah. But just before we continue with the video, it will be absolutely wild if you could put in code BW. If you put this in, you're a G. You're an absolute G. So shuck her in and then I'll be happy. But let's let's get back into the video. So what we got next is um, this stuff. Honestly, you know, there's nothing that you can do there. So we got controller. This is the one right next to um, where you change your keybinds. So I don't have auto run on. I don't use auto run. I got build immediately for builder pro. My edit hold time doesn't really matter anymore because I don't, you know, I changed my edit. Slide hold time is 0 0.088. Just so you don't get mixed up. Vibration off. If you have vibration on, I don't know what you're doing with that, but just chill out. Um, quick weapon, yep. Uh, I don't use these, I don't think. Yeah, these are, yeah. I got my build mode on 2, my edit mode on 2x as well. And then I put on use advanced options. So my look horizontal and look vertical are both 47%. My turning horizontal, they're both 16. Turning boost ramp time 0 0.2. Instant boost when building, this really helps you because you can engage instantly when the stick is fully deflected when in build mode. Then I've got ADA's look speed for 19% and then 0, 0, 0. Look dampening time, 0. And then for my look input curve, I have exponential. But whatever you have it on beforehand, just keep it on that because you're used to having it on linear. If you have it on linear, just keep it on linear. It doesn't matter. But exponential, I don't even know what this does. And my aim assist strength is 100%. Keep it on 100%. I once had it on 0% for like a year. Stupidest thing I've ever done. So keep it on 100%. Then I've got left stick and right stick dead zone at 10%. And then don't enable adaptive triggers if you have that on. Okay. I mean, just for like this extra stuff, I got toggle sprint on. I have it off because it can stuff you up. Mantle activation is hold jump. Hurdle activation is press jump. Um, auto pick up weapons, don't have that on. Auto sort consumables to the right is very good all the time. Reset building choice off. Disable pre-edit option on. This just stops the pre-edits unless you need the pre-edits in your gameplay. Have it off. Turbo building on, auto confirm edits both. Just so it just makes it easier. And then tap search, FOV minimum 75 degrees. All right guys, well, that's about it for the keybinds. If you enjoyed that video and you are, are gonna use any of these keybinds, use code BW in the Fortnite item shop and like and subscribe to the video. And see ya.